Good morning. It is Wednesday morning and I'm so excited. One more day and I have my Thursday and Friday off. How's everyone doing? I hope everyone is doing great this week. I had a fantastic um, weekend getaway last weekend. Really enjoyed that. And now what I plan on doing on my day off is getting my makeup under control meaning I've got to put away um, some makeup that I have in a box and then I have to drag in my iron back out into the kitchen area then I have to um, organize them that's what I have to do organize them okay so this morning for breakfast I had some peanut butter and toast on one slice of bread and the other I had just some butter and toast some coffee and I mixed the coffee with hot chocolate and then I had some probiotic papaya yogurt and I have to finish it up <laughs> yeah I have to finish it up but I'll do that in a few minutes Okay, let's see what's been going on. Well, I made the top on, I made the list for the top 100 in four different categories for my company. So that was fun and good news to hear yesterday. And I have an appointment today. It's gonna be one of those virtual appointments. Just have to finish up some stuff for that gentleman. And that's what I'm gonna do. I could open up some lights over here. And yeah, I was up from one o'clock this morning and couldn't go back to sleep. So I took a little Benadryl because I was in so much pain. I got my Fitbit watch, Fitbit Blaze watch, and I didn't do an unboxing. Well, I kind of did, so I'll show that video somehow. I have to work with it. Um, but here is the watch. And the reason I got it is because I have to keep holding my phone just to check my steps and I'm getting up in the office back and forth and sometimes I leave it on my desk so I'm not really getting the true reading of my steps. So, further ado, here is the Fitbit Blaze. And I like it. So what happened is when I got it the night before, so I got it on Monday, um, I was playing around with it and it, um, I found a section where it was giving me the option to do a nine minute exercise. Well, this nine minute exercise was some stretching. That nine minute exercise had me limping. Um, yesterday, I still had aches and pain in my shoulder because it had you on the ground. There were certain ones I could not do. There's no way I'm not ready for that yet. But it really loosened me up, but it gave me a lot of aches and pain. So um, I took a pain pill last night, but that didn't work. So I know Benadryl will really help, like swelling and stuff like that. So I took just a little bit of Benadryl about four this morning, and that worked immediately. That Benadryl really helps you with pain sometimes. So that helped me so I can have my day today without being in aches and pain. Um, so I guess after I start, I'll try again that little nine minute stretching routine. Anything counts when it comes to exercise. And um, even though I'm supposed to be walking around a lot on the job, sometimes you're sitting for a while and then after work, you get out at six, you, I just don't have the time for exercise. One thing I know about exercise, when you do it, you shouldn't just do it for two days. You need to be consistent with it, otherwise you can just hurt yourself. And um, so I'm going to try to do this Fitbit stuff um, or fit exercise while I um, have this watch on my hands. Now, I've been charging it every night, and I, I'm going to try to go without charging it tonight since I'm off tomorrow and to kind of see how long the battery life is for. If I can go more than 24 hours, um, and stuff then that way I don't have to charge it every night I can use it also I think you can monitor your sleeping but and then when you turn your wrist up it kind of turns back on it's a watch it gives you the date 
and stuff and then you just swipe 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 and it gives you other stuff so I'll do a video of that and finish up the video I started with the unboxing and then put that on for you yeah so let me see I went shopping yesterday and bought a whole bunch of stuff for a closing that's happening tomorrow I'm trying to figure out how to get out of my car and into their house but without having to wait until the weekend but I may have to do that so we will see we will see um, but yeah that's all I got to talk about this morning still waiting on my results from the ancestry DNA stuff I've been getting like a lot of comments from people I know family members that they really don't believe in it and I'm thinking well I don't know um, we'll see because I know a lot about my family history so if um, if it's not correct and I will definitely know I mean for someone that's probably adopted um, or don't have a history of their family members then I would say okay you know they probably can tell you anything um, but we will see okay if it's um, if they're on track or not and uh, I can't wait to share that with you I'm gonna check out the progress of it because the last progress said they had received it um, but it has not been processed yet that was last week so I will check and let you know anyway I'm gonna get ready to leave out of here um, I don't even know why I need to leave at 8.30, but I know I had something to do. Oh, yeah, I've got to go pick up a, um, a sun visor for my car. That's what I need to go do. I'm going to get one for the back of the car and one for the front. So let me head on out of here. And have a fantastic Wednesday, everyone. Take care. Bye-bye.